What's up you guys? Welcome to the video. I got tons of requests. The second that I got here to vlog to show you guys a little bit of Cancun, talk to you guys about it. Um, a lot of people ask about pricing and stuff so I'll kind of explain like the differences because I've done both like all inclusive and then not all inclusive um, and just kind of show you guys around. So hopefully you guys will enjoy this. There's going to be probably lots of multiple different clips in here. So yeah, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and here's Mexico. I just wanted to sit down and talk to you guys a little bit about the all-inclusive and everything that it entailed. I got a ton of questions about it and I just kind of want to explain it. So the all-inclusive trip that we just took that you are all viewing right now was basically you paid a certain amount and it was covering your flight, your stay, your food, your drinks, and essentially everything that entails with the resort. So that does not include excursions that you could take. It doesn't include, you know, water sports, none of that. It basically just entails that you're at the resort, you're going to get a wristband, and you're going to be able to have any drink, any food, anything that the resort can give you that you can put in your mouth, essentially. Alcohol, everything is completely free with the all-inclusive. So the price you pay is what you're going to be getting for the entire trip. Um, I have also done a non-all-inclusive where you pay as you go, and I 10 out of 10 a million times would recommend the all-inclusive over that simply because you have the entire trip to be carefree. You can go to any of the bars on your resort's property. You can go to any food place and there's so many different choices and it essentially is a carefree vacation. I was so incredibly relaxed on this trip. I had, you know, 
kind of just went all out. I t- tried new things. I ate new things. I over ate, under ate, you know, it just got drunk, like all of the above. It's everything that I personally would want out of a vacation. And I just, I feel like a lot of people want to th- go for the relaxation factor. And it truly is that with the all-inclusive. You are completely just everything is at your hands and it's an immense amount of things. So highly recommend all inclusive. And I will kind of talk about the prices at the end of the video, but just some of the things you should know if you're going to be going to an all inclusive resort, I can't speak enough good things about it. All right. So I want to show you guys like the view, but the second I walked, like literally the second that I walked outside, my lens fogged up. So I'm just going to show you guys from right here. Um, my resort is called the Ryu. It's R I U. And I'll kind of show you guys that as we go, but this is the view from our balcony. It's just a cute little, um, like pretty good space, like square that you can go out there and sit. We'll see if I can get this really, really quick. The view like just out here, it's going to fog up fast, but yeah. And then down we can literally see right below us this little entertainment area um, tons of spaces to walk around it's just absolutely beautiful with the blue waters out there you can watch the sun come up right there come to the beach like as early as possible and just stay in here and stare honestly the water is so warm so you walk in to the room and this is just kind of like an overview ish. I figured it was better to show you guys when the room was super clean than not. But to my right, this is just a bathroom in here. Super just basic little cute. Um, and then you come over here again, just kind of like an overlook. What's up? Of everything. Um, and over here we have two, oh my god, the amount of sand in my hair. Two double sinks and a really, really big jacuzzi cub tub which is really really nice and then the shower if i told you guys what i thought of this shower you would probably stop watching this video because it was the first thing i thought of. <laughs> i was like what the f is this um waterfall and um take off the head or whatever uh, i'm just doing it now because it's clean and then it's like i don't know it's just like massive and you can pull this shut and yeah so that's the shower and then that's my mom my mom doesn't come with the room. Yeah, that's. I only put. A, I only. per room. I only put away, one. Um, and then the beds. They obviously make it each day. This is super cute. Look at that. They got a bear in the other room. I don't. Hey, it's cute. I didn't. I didn't mean to. But look at him. It's a donkey. Oh, he's cute. I'm hungry. How can that even be? I got a snack. Okay. And then, so the beds are doubles, really, really tiny, but that's okay, we're making it work. And then, once again, you come out and we have the gorgeous ocean view. So, I'll just show you guys what it looks like. Hopefully it won't humid up on me. It's freaking beautiful, 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 beautiful. And that is the name of the resort right there, it's Ryu. And this kind of looks like the Bahamas, if you've ever seen that before. Lots of boats out there, so yeah. That's just like a little mini tour for you guys. Um, just got back from the beach. It's 
Sunday, Sunday, have drank zero alcohol today because I was at the pool bar yesterday, pretty much got obliterated somehow and like passed out. So, good night. So, so yeah, that little pool bar, if you guys can see it, I'll zoom in. They basically, like, it just was a really, really bad situation. Got super drunk. So, you come to the Ryu, don't go to the pool bar. Also, over here in this little section, literally, I'm not, I'm not messing around. Like, okay, so this comes with a fridge. The fridge is fully stocked. Um, it just has some Dos Equis beer, which is actually not too bad. Um, some water bottles and then some beverages in there that comes fully stocked with the all-inclusive. And this little slot closes and then they just have stuff right here for drinks. And my aunt got me this. How cute is this for, um, beer this summer? I can't wait. Um, you can put stuff in ice. They have a coffee maker, which the coffee downstairs is way, way better. But look at this. We got some Smirnoff. We got Jose Cuervo tequila, Bacardi. And I don't know what that is. I'm not sure, I'm not touching it. These are death, like literal death. I'm kind of scared of them. So basically all you do is under this faucet, you lift it up and the freaking out comes out, guys. So that's, that's some pretty wild shit. Like you don't just put that in my room specifically. When you told me that you hated my friends The only problem was with you and not them And every time you told me my opinion was wrong It tried to make me forget where I came from And I didn't want to write a song Cause I didn't want anyone thinking I still care or don't But you still hit my phone up Baby, I'll be moving on And I think you should be something I don't wanna hold back Maybe you should know that My mama don't like you She likes everyone And I never liked to admit that I was wrong It all been so caught up in my job Didn't see what's going on But now I know I'll never see you Problem was with you and not them And every time you told me my opinion was wrong And try to make me forget where I came from And I didn't want to write a song Cause I didn't want anyone thinking I still care or don't But you still hit my phone up And baby I'll be moving on And I think you should be something I don't want to hold back with some tomato and then this is scrambled egg whites and then just like an egg white thing and then some kind of pastry because the pastries are insane amazing so yeah
Alright guys, what's up? It is Wednesday, so we leave on Friday. Um, today on the beach, I actually got these two pieces of jewelry. Kind of fun and cute, if you guys care. Let me see, you can't really see it well. Let's see if I can make it look better. There it is. Super pretty, so there's like vendors on the beach that like walk around and sell jewelry and stuff, and I loved both of these. They're sterling silver. Um, shout out to my mom. And so, yeah, it is approximately like almost seven o'clock. We are going to go eat right now. Just to show you guys my outfit, this is also one of my favorites. Um, actually, just so you guys can see this shirt. This was, this is why I love TJ Maxx. Um, this shirt was $7.99 at TJ Maxx last summer. Um, I wore this at one of my friend's birthday parties and then I think I wore it at another occasion this summer. And then these shorts are just American Eagle. Um, super cute, a little bit of detailing right there. And then these shoes are Target that I showed in my story. So yeah, let's go eat. So with the all-inclusive, this is the menu. And basically, you can get anything on the menu, like at any time. I mean, there's cocktails, there's everything. This is all comes with the all-inclusive. Um, coffee, drinks, and stuff, like non-alcoholic. They don't have very many beers. I haven't got a ton of beer while I'm here. I actually just ordered one, but it's not, like, I'm not obsessed with the beers. I've kind of liked more of, like, these drinks. And, yeah. I'm pretty sure that girl they were carrying was So. Really? I'm pretty sure beers that we've had are the Takeda Light and then Sydney. Um, we'll just take more chips. Thank you. Thanks. Uh, two turns, you know, no. <laughs> and uh, Rosie's And my cousin Sydney likes this one. This is Bohemia. There's like a light one and a dark one. Pilsner. Uh, and it is a dark out and gorgeous. And we're just kind of sitting here at the bar waiting to get some dinner. Mm -hmm.